in this video, we are headed out shopping to Joanne and Michael's stores to go see what they have for spring and back to school planner releases. Let's go check it out. Hello, I'm Katie and welcome to the Planner Channel. Subscribe to watch videos like these. At the front of the whole paper craft section, they had this whole display with the new teacher collection for fall 2022 and another one with some goodies on clearance. They actually have a ton of things at the store, so I just tried to find everything and just get a little glimpse of it all. In the teacher section, there was this adorable Minnie Mouse plant or Happy Notes and then all these things in clearance so much it was a lot so i just kind of wanted to get through all of it they had a whole display of disney villains as you can see i really like that tile happy notes at the bottom there and then i really like that design a life you love over there on the right that one's really pretty the whole pride rainbow collection was there um, this section was in the back of the store and they had those um, cork boards and white erase boards back there. Here's some more clearance towards the front of the store, just like a little bit of everything mixed together. They had this clearance section in another place in the store with a whole bunch of things and then this is the newly set up Happy Planner aisle. They have a whole full aisle of all the goodies look at this look look oh my gosh everything so they have tons of stickers tons of planners and tons of accessories so i just tried to walk through and look at everything and and that may be why i didn't choose very much because they have it all I really like the Celestial collection. It's really, really pretty. That one was dashboard though, so that's not my favorite. I love the tiles. I love this collection too. Oh my gosh, you guys, here's the other planner I really liked with the roses and the glitter pink discs. And the one right next to it with the um, grapefruit, that one's really cute too. What else? Oh, I really like this task list. It's like a checklist with little boxes you can check off. Um, I've been thinking about getting this budget planner, but I'm gonna use my Notique planner instead. Here's some more of the Celestial collection. I, I don't remember the name of it. They have a ton of discs, including some of my favorites, which are, which are these iridescent black ones. They had the alphabet font stickers. I flipped through those really quick. They're really pretty, but I don't use them very often. Um, this is a really good thing, the sticker storage organizer. If you don't have one, it's super useful. They had these, uh, the plastic envelopes. So like if you're doing cash envelopes, those fit perfect, like cash or checks fit in there really well. They had several co colors of snap-in covers. They had this neutral one, they had black. And then in a second, I'll show you the other two. They had more sticker books on the bottom of the shelf and then the full hanging shelves were totally, you can see like all the stickers, so many stickers, all the stickers. <laughs> There's some more of the first round of um, the Disney Villains collection. Then they have all of these Disney things. I really liked this note paper. It's like a blush pink color. And then it has like a checklist on the back. I think this was a big size. Here's the other two snap-in covers in peach and like that neutral color. On, the, on an end cap, I found this little Sage Mini. Um, it's a line vertical, which is not my favorite layout for mini. It's just too small, but it's really pretty. Um, and they had some other teacher things there too. I flipped through one of the new teacher sticker books just to check it out. Oh my gosh, I could do this all day. Here's the gratitude sticker book. This was on my list. I really wanted it, so I got it. 
in my cart. Then later I found this new Disney Happy Planner end cap with all the indigo blue collection and some other tile ones, really, really pretty. Now let's head over to my Michael store and see what they have. Okay, so at first glance, not very much. They must still be stocking up the shelves. They only had a few pl new planners and a few sticker books. However, this one jumped out at me. It's so pretty. It's a twin loop. I don't think it comes in a disc bound and it's a dashboard layout, which I don't usually use. So I left it there. They also had the Stargazer one, which is a big, it's very pretty. And that one's a horizontal layout. So I'm still thinking about that one. I looked through the sticker collection and there wasn't a lot, just a few. And then a few clearance items on this end cap over on the side. Um, I found this one little inspirational stencil pack, which was, I really liked that. They had a ton of stickers in the main like sticker aisle, all of these glittery ones, but these are mostly for scrapbooking. They have, you know, they're raised, so they, will make a bump in your planner if you use them in your planner. And then here's some more scrapbook stickers and then all these like pretty floral scrapbook stickers. Just like so much pretty, oh my gosh. Okay, so I found this one. Look at these florals. I love this so much. I don't know what I would do with it, but I want it. <laughs> okay, here's the section with all the letters. So all the different colors and fonts and textures and glitter letters for scrapbooking or planning. Some of these are flat to use in your planner. I found this new X-Acto knife. It has a curve grip to it. I really like that. I think that could be really helpful. And then here's the Crocodile individual like single punch for disc bound planners. Of course, always go check your clearance section. Um, I found a few of these die cuts, uh, but really not really any stickers or planner things this time in the clearance section. Next up is the pen aisle. I was just looking for things I can use for brush lettering or for using on black paper or just anything that I wanted to try out. They had an open box of Papermate Inkjoy gel pens, which was on clearance for $10 because the package had been opened. I wanted to check out the mild liners and I discovered they have some mild liner brush pens that I wanted to try. And they also have a journaling set and they had some individual ones, but I couldn't make a decision. Um, here are the brush pens. So you can see it's brush on one end and super fine marker on the other end. Um, they had scented Papermate flares. Oh my gosh, you guys. Look at this, scented. <laughs> Sunday brush. And then they had these metallic ones and it says uh, glittery on white paper. If they were glittery on black paper, I definitely would have picked them up. Okay, we made it back. I picked up one sticker book, the Gratitude sticker book, which I had on my shopping list from earlier this year. So I'm happy I picked up that one. And then the little sticker pack with the um, white stickers that you can put on the black paper and they show up. So I'm excited about using those in a spread very soon. Um, I didn't pick up anything at Michael's. I, you know, I really thought about those mild liners, but I think I want a different color set. That store didn't have very much, but you just have to go and look. Now, I wanna share a few tips about shopping in your stores. Number one, make sure you're using the app and check the app for coupons. Check your mail for coupons. Um, make sure you're getting rewards points. I actually have a $5 rewards at Michael's right now I can use on something. Always check for coupons on the website, in your email, on the app, and get, um, you can get points with Michaels and Joanne on the app towards um, like Michaels Rewards. And um, it, it was like a $5 free stuff every so often. Same thing with Joanne. So make sure you're doing all those things if you wanna save some money while you're out there shopping and save some gas, make that trip worth it because oh my gosh, gas is crazy right now. If you're ready to take your planning to the next level, whether it be decorating, productivity, hand lettering, all the things, head on over to the planner school and take a class. If you like this video, make sure you hit that thumbs up button and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.